Hi, do you hope everyone? My name's Mr. Fruit, and welcome back to the Pokemon Xenoverse Nuzlocke Let's Play. And boy, we uh, you know, we got we. It's hopefully, I would say it's gonna be a recovery episode, but it's not. We're headed right into the gym. You saw last episode. What a doozy, huh? I mean, literally, it does not get closer than that when about to wipe. However, we didn't, so. The small victories. But you know what it is? Speaking of small victories, it's the hour, hour, hour of, of, of power, power, power. I think. I'm going to do it anyway because we're all emotionally drained from last episode. And let me put it this way. I'm going to try and make it an hour of power. Hopefully it ends up being an hour, if you know what I'm saying. Uh, I'm having to record this Thursday night as of the time of this recording. Uh... Excuse me, two of them don't haven't hit 5,000 likes. So remember to like the video. 5,000 likes every episode means every Friday we get an hour of power. Like today. Um, we're close. We're slacking a little bit again. But I believe in you. Uh, and I feel bad for everyone that does shoot for the hour of power. Apologies. Um, I don't know. Maybe it's because this series isn't getting as much views as the last one. So maybe I should lower the like goal. I don't know. To make it fair. But comment down below also to have a chance for a Pokemon named after you. Hopefully we get something here. It all depends on whether I think we get past this gym to get a new encounter. But let me tell you, let me tell you something. It It's been a lot. Um I have been grinding hours today to try and get everything ready to see where we could go and what team we're gonna use. I think this is the team we're going to walk into, so you don't look at the screen. Okay, hey, Chloe has made her return. The Palo Sand now, of course. Uh, Sandy Gast evolved. Uh, water compaction, decreased defense, increased speed, which is garbage, but that's okay. Knows Astonish, Hypnosis, Giga Drain, and Bulldoze. Not the best. This is the only ghost type move. Actually, hold up. Hold up. Wait, I didn't even think about this. Wait, we might pop off in a second. Hold up. Don't we have Shadow Ball? <gasps> Come on, Chloe. Oh, oh, shoot. You Panda can learn it too? So can 10? Well, don't, again, don't look. Uh, spoilers. Uh, yeah, we're getting rid of Astonish. Yeah, bad. Because the other thing too is, when is Astonish going to flinch? You're literally getting outsped by everyone. So let me double. I feel like Panda is... No, you're a special attacker. Oh. Okay, well then... I think I'm getting rid of Spirit Shackle. Whoops. Okay, uh, yeah, let's give you Shadow Ball. Hold up. We're gonna, we're gonna need everything. Trust. Uh, so yeah, let's go ahead and teach you sh uh, Shadow Ball yourself. Will 10 need it? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, and I'll show you that stuff here soon. Oh, 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 Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Wait, Avon can learn Earthquake? That could be big. Uh, yeah, we're, I think we replace Bulldoze here. No, Bulldoze was physical too, right? I guess I'm gonna have to double check that. I think, I think we might teach Avon Earthquake. He doesn't really have a hard hitting move. Like, he has Flail, which, like, is his backup move. We we have Gust. I think we get rid of Gust. He doesn't have good special attack. And what is that covering? Yeah, I think Earthquake instead of Gust. Can you not learn Acrobatics, Avon? Although, do I, do I want to teach it to you? Do I, would I rather have an item on you? All great questions. Toxic. You know, let's see if someone can learn this. Wait, actually, a lot of people can. What the fudge? Yo, Avon could? I mean, Avon is currently just the stall wall. It's not a bad idea. Chloe learning it is also not... Hmm. Would I want to maybe do this, like, instead of Hypnosis? We already have Hypnosis on team, sure. We'll, we'll give Chloe Toxic. This could be big. Avon and... I'm so sad he can't learn Dragon Claw. Oh, which reminds me. Yeah, someone told me. 
Avon's not going to learn a stab move, a dragon move, until level 58. 58, hey, huh? Jesus. I, I guess it balances him out because he's pretty cracked otherwise, but, bruh. Um, like, what else here do we want to be using? Uh, Scald being able to burn could be big. I don't know what the percentage is. Probably 20, 30 percent. No one can, Avon can learn it. Avon, what the fudge? Can Avon just learn almost every TM except Dragon Claw? Frostbite, Tree Meter, Grass Knot, Dazzling Gleam, Waterfall. Waterfall. Would we want to teach you Waterfall? Can you learn it? You can't. Oh my god, dude. Even straight up, just uh, what the fudge? Okay. Well, he might just have interesting type coverage then. Like I'm thinking maybe this instead of flail. I like that's a good. I that's a good some good type coverage right there. I like this. Okay, sure, sure, Avon. You you don't have a dragon move, but you got lots of other stuff. You have a um, eclectic repertoire. So that's probably just gonna have to do it for now. Do we protect? Because think about it. If we had protect during Slurpuff, we maybe could have PP stalled. Although I think that would have only been possible again on Twin Suns with pressure. Otherwise, I think we still would. Who would? I mean, I, I mean, Avon could protect along with Stockpile, but Chloe, Chloe just isn't that bulky. Defensively, it is, but I don't think it's special. Pain isn't bulky. I don't know. I feel like having protect would be good, but at the same time, I don't know. We're not going. Okay, so anyway, you've already seen the team. Whoops. Um, next up, we did it. I went ahead. If you go to Fort Belt Town, there's a guy who teaches your EV Dragon Pledge if you want it to, and as long as you level up while it knows Dragon Pledge. Scalion! I'm so hyped. It popped off in that last battle when we got to borrow it. It is Hyper Cutter, preventing other Pokemon from lowering its attack stat because its attack stat is dummy thick. Good defense, special defense, eh, special attack and speed, meh. But also Mono Dragon, which as we've seen with Avon, very good. Very good. And we're going to need it for this gem because we're going to sound type. Nose, Bite, Dragon Claw, Dragon Tail, and Dragon Dance. Ten is set up to just be a sweeper. If we can get a Dragon Dance or two, the idea is we just win. Hopefully. That's the plan. Next, uh, we already know Ferdinand. Ah! Listen to that thing. Gorachu. So if you're curious, yes. I went ahead, maxed happiness on so many Pokemon. I don't want to talk about it. That alone, whatever. We evolved Pika Pichu into Pikachu. And then, this is the f even more fun, once I finally did all this friendship stuff, to get Pikachu to Raichu, I need a Thunderstone. We don't have a Thunderstone. You know how you get a Thunderstone at the point I'm in the game? You find it off a of Wild Electric, which is a 5% chance encounter in the rail station back in that last town, which, once you find an Electric, has a 5% chance to hold a Thunderstone. So quick math will tell you, those aren't good odds. Can confirm, they were not good odds. That was most of the ground. I'm not going to lie to you. So we've all did to Raichu. Once you get Raichu, you go to the... What town? Fudge. So, uh, Winton, why, uh, what? No, yeah, this one right here. Yeah, 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 with the Geist. You go uh, into their hideout. You talk to um, Chrysler, the nerd scientist. He teaches Gorichu, or, well, Raichu, Thunderstruck. And leveling up with Thunderstruck gets you Gorichu. So the cool thing about this is apparently this is a scrapped Mon they originally had to evolve Raichu in, in Gen 1 or maybe Gen 2. Uh, never made it. But so, like, that's part of the cool little Easter egg. Um, and frankly, it looks and is apparently real strong. Uh, yeah, so Thunderstruck, 150 damage. Granted, you have to recharge. So it do be committal, but could come in huge. Otherwise, we do have Thunderbolt, Thunderwave, and Sweet Kiss. Um, literally, 
I can't like teach it anything else. Like not even the move tutor. Like this is it. So, um, but good attack, good special attack, just some good stats all around. Static as well could be huge. Uh, and again, sound type, need electric. You're gonna notice we don't have the Rapidash. Yes, because as I realized, slight problem. It's only flying type until it hits 50% HP, and then it turns into electric flying. But the problem is, even like even though Draco can die, we probably wouldn't have used him either because um, flying's weak to sound though. So not a great matchup still. So actually, we really need to gorge you. Uh, we've got Panda the Hanjid back in here. I don't. I, I'm kind of worried. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about Hanji yet. Panda. We could have done the abomination thing. Maybe I should have. I don't know. But I didn't. Actually, that's the one thing I forgot to do. Uh, Side Beam Hypnosis Dream Eater. Uh, you just saw more. Shadow Ball. And last but not least, Avon is back. Um, wasn't going to plan on using Avon, um, but the whole leveling system too has just gone tits up now that um, all these people died. So, uh, we got Avon. And you just saw him learn all those moves. That's the team I'm looking at here. The team I'm hoping to use. I'm actually going to raise the, uh, uh, whatchamacallit, Palisand one level. Um, another thing, too, is it took hours, and I have rare candies because there's so much involved in everything. So... None of them have EVs. <laughs> uh, it's, it'll be fine. It'll be, I'm sure it's fine. But that wasn't all we did. I also prepared some other things, just in case. Um, oh, shoot. Wait, no. Yeah, I literally just need to go to the graveyard and evolve this dude. Frankly, I might do that right now. Just to compare to Hanjid. Because if it's a little bulkier, I think we're going to use it. Uh, we went ahead. We got Rapidash all the way up. Cool Mon. Oh, yeah, I didn't. Oh. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah, I'll show you. I'll show you guys this stuff. Hold up. Aldom. Yeah, I evolved Swaggloon. I tried to get its happiness up. It should evolve soon if we need it. Um. Oh, yeah. All right. So, yeah, let me show you all the fun stuff. So, we evolved Manticure again. Friendship. Level up at night. That, as you can see, Sooth Bell. Yeah, I'll actually take that back. Nope, nope, give, give, give me the item. Thank you. Um, it's adorable. Fat, fat tail, fat tail. I don't actually know how, no, I'm going to say it. Fairy poison, very interesting. Good attack, good speed, average everything else. Cute charm, might infatuate. We've got charm for minus two attack, which I think could be pretty clutch. Dazzling gleam, taught it with a TM. Thunderfang for some coverage. And poison jab. Also for possible paralysis. Uh, poison jab for some good stab as well. That's Fat Hail. We got the Betna Ponyta up to Rapidash. Again, flying type. Cloud Burst. The Pokemon becomes electric type when its HP is halved. Now granted, it might lose flying type. I'm not sure. But either way, having to only fight when it's down like that, eh, I'm worried. So, I don't want to throw him in yet. Uh, super fast. Plus, we have, like, that's a great nature on Rapidash here. It knows Cotton Guard for some defense. Uh, Discharge for Stab once it turns electric. Air Cutter and Acrobatics for both physical and special coverage. And then we evolved Reindeer. It turned into this thing. Rindigo. I would have saved it for the video so you could see my reaction had I known this would have happened. It's not even fairy type anymore. It's a dark type because it's your sleep paralysis demon. Um, great attack, good defense. But here's the thing, defeatist. So lower stats when HP becomes half or less. So it do be tanky, but if it hits half, it's no longer tanky. However, what I'm liking in this lock are solo types. So after this jam, he might have a place on the team. But, hold, Defeatist isn't all lost because it learns Entrainment, which means I can give Defeatist to anyone we battle, 
which could be huge. And now it's payback, heart stamp, and draining kiss. It actually still doesn't learn a dark type stab move. I had to reteach this from its earlier levels. Um, but it's a little tankier, like I said. Does some more damage. And we can give other people defeatist. And then we have Regis here, who I'm going to go fly uh, and evolve real quick. So give me a second. Now, before you say anything, all right, I already know that, you know, this episode's already a little delayed. That's why it's kind of an honorary hour power, even if we didn't get there. Uh, this should level it up or evolve it. I'm trying to learn Shadow Ball. Oh, gee. well, I could have taught you that anyway, but. Um, yeah, let's get rid of Lick. Although, are you a physical or special attacker? I don't know. Perfect. Okay. So Regis is evolving into this homunculus thing. Homunculus. Uh, ab abomination. But he's our abomination. Oh, look at him. My little Frankenstein. Once torn slash. That that big of a deal for you? Okay. Depending if we want to add trick or treat. I mean the thing is it adds ghost type, it doesn't change their type. But it would make certain Pokemon better. Especially if we like have Ryan Deagle on the team, can throw in a dark type. Uh let me just see what your stuff is first. Let's see. Let me I'll be up one more time too, so stat-wise, again too, no EVs. Um, but what are we working with? I like tanks. Definitely tankier. And actually way more of a special attacker. Uh, also his Voltus Orb. Wait, was that a thing? But oh, Wait, that's pretty big. Special attacker. Go Psych- ah, Okay, I, I, I think we do this over Hanji, frankly. Right? Yeah. Sheesh. Uh, do I care about Sucker Punch? Yeah, it's not bad. Okay, well, I yeah, welcome to the team, Regis. And now we pray that um, we make it past this gym. There's a lot to address from last episode, too. A lot of people were petitioning that we ignore the Xeno, Xeno verse clause where, you know, if Ferdinand dies, someone else from the party has to die. And since... Uh, Twin Sons was the only one left, he had to die. That instead, we should, you know, either give him a free pass, because he s survived and carried it, or do a new party and roll the number again to randomize it. And as much as I would like to, I think it's a fitting end. Twin Sons, I trust me, I want Twin Sons on the team. Turns out, yeah, dude is sick. But... What better way to go out than literally saving the lock? He went out a hero. Literally saved the lock. And rules are rules. Sometimes we bend them. But I think in this case, it's a fitting end. And it sucks. It does. Because otherwise, we'd be able to carry him on and he could survive. But, like, the that clause helps and hurts us. Because we get to keep our starter, who's pretty strong. But other times... Like that, it hurts. So, I'm sorry. Um, trust me, yeah. I, I was just, Requiem surprised me, to say the least. And I would love to ha continue to have him on the team. But alas. Also, to all, the, of course, there's all the backseat gamers telling me how I could have, you know, done the fight differently. Let's go ahead and start with, you should have known it was poison type. Bruh. Yeah, Maybe. But the, the game literally baited me. They called Geist. And they kept making Ghostbuster references. So they baited me. I'm like, okay, well, it's Ghost type. So I didn't really think about anything else. I'm like, oh, well, just make sure I got something for Ghost type. Number one. Number two, going into the fight and thinking about, oh, well, you could have done this or that. Okay, well, first off, had I known going into the fight that by the end of it, everyone but one Pokemon would have died, I would have played differently because at the beginning, I'm playing damage control to try and lose nobody. But if I knew we're going to have to be losing almost everybody, I would have done things a little bit differently beforehand to try and mitigate all the damage. Thirdly, the getting greedy with Hone Claws. Yes and no. I was Hone Clawing because 
I literally don't think I had enough PP to kill them if um, I didn't home claws. Now, I probably should have stopped. I could have stopped at one or two. But the other thing is they showed three moves. They'd already shown me three moves. Toxic, uh, Drain Punch, and Venoshock. And I'm like, okay, that's fine. Totally fine. On top of that, I kept using those. And even moves that couldn't affect me. So I was like, okay, well, this is just like the last boss fights where we had something that the AI didn't know what to do against. So it must not have anything. Oh, Earthquake. We're also times four weeks. So we get one shot every day of the week. Didn't know I had Earthquake. Wasn't even a thing. I, why? You know? So that happened. Um, and then there were all these little micro things. That's the point. Is first off, it's really easy to see on the outside perspective what you could have done. Secondly, it's why like, for instance, I enjoy not doing this live, for instance. Maybe I'll do another like at some point live, but like during a fight, for instance, like I wouldn't want to read chat because the whole point is I'm the one making the battle because like if I had chat, then we could slowly all come to agreement on the best plan, you know, but that's not fun. So yeah, there were some micro issues here and there, but also if some RNG had gone differently here or there, it wouldn't have been as bad. The biggest misplay was not continuing to Iron Head. However, Iron Head was a 20% chance to flinch, I believe. So we were going to get earthquaked eventually. Could have been one turn. Could have been three more. It depends on how long we flinched. But we were dead there no matter what. Anyway, just that. And I'm going to be honest. I also underestimated it. It's a slurp off. I was like, yeah, it's a boss battle, but it's a slurp off. Oh my God. And I think a lot of you felt the same way. Like, never did I think a slurp off is going to be the final boss. I know we're also 20 minutes in this episode and we're just showing off. To, there's a lot to get to. Okay. Plus, I just spent all day doing this, all right? So let me just show you, you know, a lot to get to, a lot to touch on. It's unfortunate. We're still going. That's the important thing. Um, and yeah, here's to praying for the gym. I also forgot to explain why I picked who I did for the gym battle fight here. So let me do that also. So yeah, we're going to... We're not going to go with Hanjeet, I don't think. Um, we'll see if that uh, ends up panning out or not. Um, and I don't think, like, I know, like, for instance, like, Sarah here isn't a bad pick. It's not super effective, in it, but, but, yeah, like, I don't know. Maybe Sarah could pull out some clutch plays here and there. So here's my thinking. Palo Sand for Slurp Huff. Because he took the slurp off. So I'm going to assume he's going to use that slurp off. So I need something. And currently, literally, our only ground type right now, too, is Palisand. Palisand's on the team. Scalion, solo dragon type. First off, good against sound, but also pretty strong, turns out. Uh, Avon, same idea. Solo dragon type. We don't have a dragon move, but we resist a lot of stuff. Bulkier. Um, go Psychic here. Um, psychic, I think, resisting sound. Yes. Psychic resists. So that's one of my thinking here. Um, resist some types. Ferdinand. Actually. Hold on. Maybe I... It seems like a bait to not use Ferdinand, but... Is perhaps Sarah the play over Ferdinand? Ferdinand's just, you know, all around good. Scorched Ashes could really help, especially in like the gym battle. If I could open up with Scorched Ashes, for instance, which I actually I don't think about it's probably a good idea. But poison. I'm assuming we're going to find some poison types. So, I I think we'll stay with this. I, I think we'll stay with this. Um, Gorichu, because electric type, monoelectric, resists and deals dummy thick damage to sound. Also, only electric type. That's the team I'm thinking. Everyone else either just doesn't really do anything or is weak or, you know, yada, yada, yada. So, that's my thinking. That's, that's where I'm at with that. Will it pay off? Not a clue. <laughs> 
not a clue. But I am certainly hoping it will. I'm trying to decide what we want to lead with. And also... Is there... Can, oh, wait. Can Regis maybe learn Toxic? You know what would be Toxic? Giving him Toxic and Protect. Is that cheesy? Yeah. But... Maybe we stall wall our way out of there. Where, where are the fudges? To toxic? To Hello? Oh, I, I don't know why I couldn't see. So he says? <gasps> he can. I think we do that over trick or treat, frankly. And then maybe protect over sucker punch? I mean, it would be nice to have priority and possibly finish something, but... It's slimy, but I'm going to do it. He's really going to be our wall. Screw it, right? Hey, you, you know, you got to do what you got to do. So let's go with that. And I think that's the team. So let's save. Let's head into the gym. I also have to figure out the puzzle first. So Lord only knows how long that'll take. But I think this is the team. God hoping we come out alive. Um, because the other thing too is after that fight, we're also down a lot of fake mod. I'm gonna be honest, kind of running out. Use the ball. We're gonna have to return to like using normal Pokemon because I don't really have a choice. So, oh, before I do go in though, and I throw, oh, did I take items off everyone? Hold on, I need to give like, um, I can't, I don't remember your name yet, buddy. Regis leftovers. That's for sure. I, I don't think I took like any of the items off the people that what? No, maybe I I think I I think I'd hold on. I think for the most part I did. But yeah, uh yeah, if you're if you're the wall, we're gonna need you to buckle where where am I what am I doing with my life? Where's the apple? The great apple. Is left is leftovers on overheat? I think leftovers might be on overheat. Hold on. In fact, I'm just gonna take all items off because I don't remember. Well, no one needs the fighting band. Plus, we have eight bajillion of those. Miracle seed? No, we don't need that. Uh, item take leftovers. Copy that. Item take King's Rock. Doesn't really matter. We also had extras, so my bad. They're like, oh wow, you're gonna use this? No, sorry, baited. My bad. <laughs> Oops. Oh, it's finally my moat. Where are you going? <laughs> uh, uh, Trainer? Okay, Regis. You got that. Although, even Avon with leftovers could be spicy. They're both kind of our walls. I don't know. Critical hit ratio. So boost accuracy. I'll need double check. Quinn's... Quinn's a little inaccurate. Between Thunderstruck not being guaranteed and the confusion thing, I think that's good because it, you know, helps us a little bit. Ooh, what else would you guys like? Focus Band. I don't really know that would go on anyone. Boost move, but only uses one. I don't know about that. I don't really know. We don't have a lot of other items that kind of just work all around. Um, soft sand for our Chloe. I mean, it could even maybe give you quick claw, but which makes me think, what do we do for Scalion? Uh, critical hit ratio. Might even just go quick claw. I mean, we're kind of fast, but well, as soon as well, yeah, as soon as we get, I think like one drag D dance, like we're pretty much good to go. So let's let's go with that. Okay, I think that's more or less the items we're gonna use. We're thirty minutes in. I know it's just like a full episode. Now we're headed in. Maybe I'll make I'll make it a little longer than an hour. All right.
plus. We might not even hit the hour goal. All right. So there's a lot to do, a lot to talk about. You know, it was it was it was an episode yesterday. So you know, we need to have a little one on one, a little ch chit chat. Plus, I yeah it changed so many mods. Okay. I got to pull up the Instagram. Um, I don't really know how <laughs> interactive this part's going to be. I might just be doing this on my own for the most part. And then I'll just clue you guys in when I figure it out. Okay. Scan, scan the QR code. Quit being cringe. I'll just show you the pictures I'm working with. Uh, it's just him singing. Uh, and then in English, it says, Hear the sound of the jungle boys. So uh, whatever that means. Next up, we have... Uh, him in a tough position. Uh, and he says, It's been a while since my first gold record, Rags to Riches, but it's still the same emotion. After a single week since its release, King of the Jungle is now a gold record. Don't stop to pump that up. Here we have him uh, doing a rap battle, I assume. It says, You told me to go away from a lull looking elsewhere to success, and so I did. But look at me now. I'm here again to rock my music. Right back at you, old geezer. This time he's in a recording studio, and this one's a little more obvious. In the comments, there's arrows. Uh, reached for the stars after a life of struggle and dedication, and it shows some sort of a path. This one has him doing a PokeWest advertisement, I believe. Um, the device you were waiting for. Yeah, just hashtag ad. This time he's, uh, showing off his own merch. Says, a real king of the jungle always wears it. This one has him, I think, just showing the album and the song names. Says the king of this urban jungle is back, baby. He's now sitting atop a throne and it says, I'm in my place now, which also looks like the fairy type gym throne. I don't know if that matters. Then it's him with that Hercules or whatever saying, uh, I'll rock this all if only you're going to be my strength. So, which I don't understand. I don't think that's sound type, but it could be wrong. Okay, so with all that, let's figure out what exactly that means. Um, do I go. Um, seems like I need a specific ticket to go up. What? Do I need to talk to people? I took some pics. I'm going to get tons of like. Hold on. Let me see. Let me see if they say. Welcome to the gym. Here, ground floor, you'll find Mr. Dice Fan Club. The first place to converse with other aficionados. In addition, if you're interested in learning more about our show, starting, check out the info screens. Um, yep. Okay. Uh, I'd re I've already talked to all these people, though. Sure when you a lot of ways cooking is like music. Uh, I would have never thought that would have been my other person, yet Lord Luck smiled at me, and he had golden teeth. Wallace, Daddy himself, gave me two tickets for the rock room here. Oh. What? You need one to challenge Daddy at the gym? Well, I guess I'll give you one, but it's going to be my responsibility. So, I'll make sure you're worthy of training first. Let's fight. Oh. Who's in the lead? Is it Gorchu? Wait, who, who'd I put in front? Wait, Wigglytuff. Oh, is Wigglytuff sound type now? Really? What are you? Fairy sound? What the fudge? I, oh. Uh. Huh? Okay. Fairy. Sh I, th I think you're fairy. If so, Ferdinand should be good into this? Yeah, I guess we'll find out. Hit me with the gy gyro ball, really. Well, let me hit you with the boom bust. Okay, you are fairy type. All right, I'm not crazy. I'm assuming fairy sound. Good to keep that in mind. Here, take it. The ticket is all yours. I got the rock ticket, dude. Heck yeah, brother. All right, well. Going up. Going to the rock room. Heck yeah, man. Duh. Do you think they're gonna metagame it? Like, will they? Will there actually be rock Pokemon? I, I have no idea what to expect. Oh Jesus! I know you would have got the first ticket easily, Fruit. This is the Rock Room, the first floor of the Hypalian Gym, and the most exciting one. To progress, you'll need to get the next ticket, but first you need to find a way to get through the audience. As usual, the hidden hidden Walls Daddy's Instagram page. All right. If you get caught in the crowd, security will come and help you. Just hit the R key to call it. Uh, you need her her Hercules strength to pass through the army of rabbit fans. Okay, is this the um Okay. I'm assuming this is the arrow key one. 
Makes sense too because he's in the recording room and this looks like his recording room. So if we go, I don't know, it has to. Sh I don't know if I start here. So whatever. Down, down, right, right. No. Down, down, right, up. Wait, what the fuck? Okay, maybe not. Can I talk to any of you guys? Uh, I don't have the Poke West thing for this, though, do I? Oh, well, oh. Wait, technically I do. Do they really want me to just shove people? Um. Well, would you leave that? <laughs> doosh, 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 doosh. I didn't know they were being so literal with it. Uh. What happens if I, I can't step on those? I need to push him back. I, I can keep pushing you. Push you up, up. And then... Hmm, wait. Uh, I can push you all the way to the right, but then I'm stuck. Uh, maybe I didn't need to do that extra one. Because then I'm stuck there, I think. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think I... Wait, I can't push you? I can't push you either. Uh, uh, wait, fudge. I think I just boned myself. I can't push her any further. Uh, what, what? Oh, there we go. If I push him up, then I'm stuck. Do I need, uh, oh. Okay, Pog. We did it! Hey! Hello, friends. The crowd loves my voice! Um... You guys gonna give me a ticket, or...? How about you? You? Oh. I'm Tina, the basis of the rock and roller. Uh, it's funny, because she kind of looks like that, uh, bread and... Bremen form. Uh, that opens the Wallace Daddy's concerts. You need that ticket to go up, don't you? If you want to tell me... Tell you something, fight me first. Come on. You were challenged by Basis Tina. Oh, you know what's funny is. No. Okay, I don't think that. Yeah, that was the route to push people. Cricket Tune. Okay, well, that's not the best start. Cricket Tune as sound type does make a lot of sense, frankly. And I'll be honest with you, Chief. That makes sense. Let's swap to Tin Huh? Let's get Scaly on in here, yeah? Show him what you can do. Your, your defense is lower, though. Minus two, but you're fine. Because you're just... You're just... You're just... I did dance once. We're just going to Dragon Claw. Let's see what happens. You got high attack. You're fine. I'm just worried about my minus two defense, but... Bremen, which is... Electric sound. Crunch. We eat those. And we destroy you. <laughs> oh my. Okay, 10 do be doing some dummy damage. Yes, sir. You strung me tight as a base. What a shame I lost in front of all these people. By the way, I ain't got no ticket, but maybe Jimmy the Guitar should have one. What the fuck? So I gotta fight everybody here? Is that what you Man, and then I'm gonna fight him. Like, well, I don't actually have it, but you could fight. Bruh. Do, do, do. Yeah, yeah. Why don't. First off, yeah, get Chloe out of the, the lead. What are we doing here? Aside from throwing. Should I get. Let's get Quinn in on some of it. I just want to see what he looks like. Although, wait. He he will have the Bremen form that's electric, and he'll resist electric, so hold on. Heard you knock the stuffing out of that tall stick, Tina. Okay, I'm up next then. I'm Jimmy. Let's shake hands. I'm the electrifying guitarist of the Rock and Roller. 
There's a ticket you want, let me tell you I ain't got it, but you're not backing out for such a thing, do you? What? I ain't backing out. Bro, I just want the... Okay. Does that mean there's four forms of Bremen? Because we've only seen the electric and... Well, I think the other one's still electric. Whatever one we just fought. I don't actually know. Wait. Is it Arbuck sound type? No shot, right? It is. That's kind of sick. Just goes to show me. I man, is there? <laughs> need like a pamphlet to show me everything that's changed. Cause good low, bruh. You're gonna do negative damage. Forget about it. My puppies are freaking out about something over there. I don't know if you can hear them. Probably they're very loud. Even though they're all the way downstairs, but whatever. They're not gonna give it up. Okay, so we already got a beater on our hands, and I know I've cursed it, but. Damn, dude, you totally blacked me out. Oh, for the ticket, try asking that Tubbo Dave, the drummer. Um. Okay. Now I'm gonna try Quinn. If it doesn't work out, rip. Um, but let me heal up 10, and I need to go see what my puppies are freaking out about because they won't stop until I do. <sighs> Hit me with the vocals. The crowd loves me. Oh, never mind, the drummer. What? Oh, huh? What a Pokemon battle? Yeah, why not? Everyone's sitting there in the audience like... They stop to keep battling? What? Ladrid, that's... Th when I thought of sound type, that's frankly the first thing I thought of. Oh, oh, that's a big boy. He's not animated, but it don't matter. Uh, Thunderbolt should do the trick. Ha! Oh, a crit too? Gorichu, chill. Chill, Quinn. Okay, Bremen. <laughs> oh, it's like, um, uh, is it called a Toto drum? What are those called? But yeah, that's so cool. Um, is he rock type? Are they different? You gotta think they're different types, but I mean, still killed you. I like the sound too. It just sounds like a big drum. Everyone's all about, I can't do anything about it anymore. Like, I don't, I don't know what to do. You sure are strong, kid. Oh, you're asking for a ticket. I don't have it. Freddy the front man. Oh. Freddy Mercury. Like, no, no, no. I got it. You need a ticket. Well, you're pretty lucky I have one here. But I'm going to give it to you only if you rock the Pokemon Classic. I will say that like every single one of these gems in this game has already been cooler than any Pokemon. Bandion. Wait. There's a sound type EV? That's so cool. I think I still, for our team, I think the dragon still works better. Because we're always going to have Ferdinand. But that's sick. That's a cool look. Oh, wow. And you apparently are tanky. It's not going to do much, but... Huh. The more you know. And then it's going to have a the last Bremen form, I'm assuming. Which we haven't seen before. Um... Oh, that's so cool. Is it like psychic type or something? Could be flying. I don't know. But I know Thunderbolt's going to hurt. It's going to hurt a lot. Gorchu is... Pretty beefy, let me tell you. Style and elegance intertwined in an authentic show. Here's the ticket. Thank the lords. I'll be taking that. Get off the stage. <laughs> Now go. Yes, sir. Right away, sir. The dance room. Dance. 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 Do do do. Bam. Do 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 do. Let me say. Oh. Oh, I like this remix. Oh, okay. What do we want in the front? I just, I can't stop people from leveling. I mean, we, just, we can keep going with Quinn, it's fine. You're doing great, Fruit. I see you have rhythm in your blood. <laughs> this is the dance room, a chock full of breakers and dance experts. Are you a good dancer, by the way? The hit as usual. It hit the wall Instagram page. Uh, I'm assuming I have to dance correctly. And I'm assuming that's the thing I saw. 
So I just have to figure out though, where do I start the dance? Yeah, where am I trying to get? I'm afraid if I talk to everyone, they'll fight me. Hey, yeah, this is the VIP area. Okay. They are chatting. They are chatting. Now, this is music, not that rock garbage. Okay, and he's just a trainer. Well, Bumper's been doing crazy things. Neubat. This one makes sense. Because as we saw, he has Neuvern or whatever, which makes sense. Definitely pegged them more for... Although, are they dragon type? They are. Oh, they are. Which means don't send out the dragon types against us. So, best we got is neutral. We don't have fairy type with us, do we? I don't think so. What? What in the dickens? Ta Takako? Tokako? What is this? I don't know. I'm assuming it's sound type, though. What in the nanny is this? It do be sound top and it do be dead. <laughs> oh, I wonder if that's the graffiti Pokemon. It looked kind of 2D. And it's like Doodle Bob. Doodle Mon. Level 50. I, wait, what? Oh. Really? It's not a stab move, but it is a dragon move. But he wants to learn D dance. I'm trying to think if it's worth it. To what, like stockpile a couple times, then D dance a couple times, and then sweep everybody? What? Yeah, and like what? What moves do I keep? Do I, do I keep Earth? I feel like I keep Earthquake. Screw it. Sure. Why not? I'll let Avon try and live his best life. Okay. It's Maldred. Waiting for an x -Bot. You gotta think... Uh, which, by the way, Killer B, that's an Naruto guy I was thinking of, which... It, he's not the Hokage, first of it, because it's also got the... Uh, Ryukaze, or Rizuka, Rizuka, whatever the fudge. They all have different Kage names. Um, and he's like the brother to that guy. I was getting mixed up. Mixed up. But yeah, he's Killer B. That's what I was thinking of. Which, that side thought made me forget whatever I was going to say. Um, do I have to talk to these people? I'm trying... I'm trying to figure out who... Where... I don't understand. Maybe talk to this person? He's 100% going to fight me. Dude, if you're here to request music, I'll have you know you got to wait. Meanwhile, I'll go and hit the dance floor. I mean, I just don't understand. I mean, it's literally hashtag dance, but I just don't understand. Do I talk to this? Tr I don't know. Whatever. I'm going to do the dance. I'm assuming I'm going to have to fight them. I don't think there's anything to do. Hey, I'm the king of the dance floor here. So I think I start here. And then, yeah, okay. I think I'm going to have to fight all these people on the dance floor, but. C'est la vie. Wait, Smurgle sound type? Just regular Smurgle? I'll be honest, that one kind of surprised me. We're going to run out of PP. He's not. Okay, so he's just normal type. Wait. <laughs> Ow, Dome. What's going on, E? Broombug do be. Sound type. That much I know. It is true. And I owe it all to you. Oh, I. Loudred, Loudred, Loudred. Yo, let's hit him with the Thunderstruck. <laughs> Boom. You're very dead. Very dead. Yes. I'm not worried about that. Okay, so... Well, sheesh. I mean... I keep going with Quinn. I do have a... Berry that should restore some PP, right? Uh, Lepa Berry. That's right. Uh, Thunderbolt. Wow, that's incredible. Let me go ahead and save. Oh, the thing is uh, actually highlighted. Uh, okay, so yeah, this is definitely it. So yeah, I fight in front of her and then I go right up, right down, right, right, up, up, right, 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 down, right, up, down, down, left, left, 
or one down, whatever. You guys don't care about that, but Jig Jigglypuff makes sense. I mean, obviously Wigglytuff too, but especially if you've watched uh, the original anime. Jigglypuff. She was she was sound type before, you know. They even realized they should chat. Out also makes a lot of sense. You know, it, the more I play, it, it really sound type just makes a lot of sense actually. And they already have so many mons designed around seemingly sound type. Without sound type, I'm just saying it could be a thing. Okay, so right up, right down, right, right up, up, right, right. Down, right, down, down, left, down, and we're good. Huzzah! Breaker Kate. Lopini. Oh, no. She's sound type? I don't know. I, don't, I feel like she's not. I feel like we're getting baited. Just kind of like with the Smurgle. Unless Smurgle's another type that... Yeah, no, you're just normal. I don't really... Ha <laughs> ha! Get static, stupid. But also headbutt me again. Oh. I mean, um, yeah, I get knocked out. She's Chloe Gold. Yeah, yeah, I, like what? I can't do anything about the levels anymore, man. Like what the fudge? Um, left. Oh. Well, we do that. Hey, kid. Huh? You are terrific. Come here at the DJ booth. Come on. Show me your moves. Man, that was cool. Those dance steps were totally insane. Let's see if you're worth going up to the Golden Studio. Everybody wants to fight me, man. What's this about? What's that about? DJ J. Bremen. Oh, really? We're neutral type, but... What are you going to do against us also? So... Overdrive. <laughs> Next. <laughs> He's a peaser. It's a lack of Sunday morning. What Next. Loudred. Okay. And that's your last one. Well, then let's end it with a Thunderstruck. And granted, it is a 99% chance we hit that. So there's a 1% chance. With a crit, I could only imagine how much damage that just did. How many how many times over did we just kill that poor Loudred? That's what I'm thinking. They also randomly go into Italian or French sometimes. There's something you're not good at. Ha <laughs> Here's your ticket to get to daddy. Studio ticket. Oh, my. am I done? Maybe. Good luck, homie. Thanks, man. All right, well then, uh, let me first go back and heal uh, and get my, my prepare back. And then, um, yeah, I guess, do I want, do I want a f flying type or a fairy type for Neugren? Just what I'm thinking about. Huh. Because, uh, where the fudge am I going? Um, who would we use? We did just get Manticure. That's only fair. Because, um, Rain Digo, you know, changed out of fairy. We lost two fairies in, uh, well, the infamous fight, you know. We have Fire Fairy with Chew Bunny, but. I think that's it, huh? Uh, might serve us better than Ferdinand, frankly. E let's try it. It feels w well, again, though, leading with Scorched Ashes. Having everyone for the rest of the game have minus one attack, whatever, on their preferred offense. It's really nice. I need something for Slurpuff. Everyone else is... So, this main one is... They just resist. But also, he's our tanky mod. Uh, I don't... I don't know. Dragon... So. Wait. No, does sound type resist fairy? I don't remember. We don't, right? It does. Oh, never mind. It'd be neutral anyway. Okay. 
Yeah, I, I was thinking about it. I was like, wait a second. Okay, so never mind. This, this is the team. We're gonna leave with Ferdinand and the uh, Ash. How can I not remember the name of it? You know what I mean. Scorched Ashes. That's it. We're gonna leave with that, and we're gonna be great. Okay. Deal. And break. Really? R really? R R really? What? Bruh. Okay. Don't have to be any more shenaniganery. Let me just let me just fight him. You know, let me go. The Golden Studio. Hey. Golden Studio. Is this where we went before we um lost about every single mod? Do 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 it is. Do we go through here? Oh, someone managed to get up here. Incredible. Mr. Daddy is just ahead, but before you reach him, I want you to answer a simple question. What is the title of his first album that was certified as a gold record? Rags to Riches, I think. I think King of the Jungle is the name of the song. Uh, let's see. It's been a while since my first gold record, Rags to Riches. Yep. Correct, you really are a long-time fan. And now let's talk about us. If you want to pass through here, you'll have to get through my honor as a manager. All right. One last... Wait. What's that? What the... <laughs> Sebastian? Hey, yo. Hold up. What the fudge? I forgot what this turnip-looking thing is. I apparently sound type. What uh, What else? Uh, I don't know. I'm going to leave with Scorch Dashes here, too. We're going to be... What the fudge? Why did it just go Italian on me? Again. Okay, I don't know what it said, but... Probably fine. Flamethrower! Although Boom Burst is technically. So you are. I think you're grass type. Grass sound? Probably. Could be bug, but. Wigglytuff. Uh huh. Lowered attack. You were scorched. You fiend. Wait, you're fairy type. Wait. What the fudge? You stole my ring? Well, that's weird because my form's fine. Wait. Did you survive? Do you have a focus? What? How did you? Wait, I'm confused. I don't know what just happened there. Because fi fire resists fire, right? Am I crazy? Maybe I'm crazy. Could have sworn. What? Hold on. I'm checking. Uh. No, it's not. Is fairy into... No. Why did I think fire interacted with fairy? I think I mistook it for dragon. I don't know. I don't know. Sebastian. You proved to me you are a worthy opponent, and I'm sure Mr. Daddy will think so as well. But you have to be in full health to face him, so let me hear you. Well, that's nice. Thank you. Thanks, friend. Let's go ahead and save, as, as is tradition, before any gym battle. No matter the game. Yeah, we got our scorched ash. Uh, are these hit? Oh, I thought these were items. I was like, don't mind if I do. You! El Diablo, if I could. Oh. This slurp off would feel my wrath. Let me tell you what. Oh, yeah, you're a tough one, aren't you? I thought I hit the clues to get up here better, but you got me. Ha ha ha. You went from rags to riches, but I'm sorry, buddy. You went straight into the lion's golden fangs, all in one bye. In this urban jungle, there can only be one king. If you want my crown, come and get it. But first, let me put a powerful beat. I want to be all fired up for this battle. Come on, I'll sell my fangs dearly. I don't even think it's the gold grill. He does have Arbok. I was expecting more of like a, a remix form, you know? But hey, what do you do? Intimidate. Well, that's fine. Let me set up Scorched Earth. Policy. Okay, it keeps... Okay, it said something in Italian. I don't know if it prevented it. I'm assuming it just said I spread them. I don't know. Uh, so... Again, I think Boom Burst is technically stronger for us. It's a lot of damage. Um... Oh, okay, so here it is. Noivern. Special attack fell. We do be weak. We are Shine Time. We need, we need to recognize that we are also weak here. So, I think Quinn. Avon's 50. I haven't even used you. Why? Uh, 
Um, okay, so we could try our stall strategy here. The toxic and stuff. Um, well, I just don't know. I, I feel like... Eh, nah, let's go reduce. Although if he uses dragon type, we don't resist that. But... Subwoofer, we we do resist that. Oh, we oh we resist that. Oh my, let's go. Let's hit him with the toxic subwoofer, please. You pleb, you're badly poisoned. Stupid. Now now peep this. Ready? With the leftovers too. Oh my god, we're back to full health. Peep. Ready? Wah 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 wah. Protect subwoofer. You missed. I heal. You take more poison damage than normal. It's gonna keep compounding. So let's hit him with the uh, good old Shadow Ball. Okay, Dragon Pulse, we're fine. I'm liking this tank strategy. Yes, sir. Oh, ah. Uh, I'm not sure. Hyper Potion, that makes sense. I should have seen that one coming. Now, nah, whatever. All right. But this turn of Toxic. Eh, no, maybe not. I might need to do. I'll take one more hit. Uh, but. I think I can get away with Protect and killing him next turn. Survey says? Yes. Oh, 100%. Unless he uses another Hyper Potion? Totally fine. Totally. Okay, we just baited out both his Hyper Potions. I'm assuming he only has two. So that's actually big. Uh, and I think we just kill here. Hey, yo. Regis kind of nice with it. Let's go, Regis. You might be the answer we've been seeking. Level 48. Yes, sir. Uh, Skahu? Oh, Scravroom. You are bug type. That's true. No, thank you. Uh, which means good matchup for Ferdinand here. We take these. Yes, sir. What you gonna do? Sub- Oh, you didn't even hit me with your bug type, dude. Speed boost, though. Ooh, you, are you are gonna be speedy, aren't you? But my flamethrower will destroy you. You crit me with that one. Nice. And I'm flinched. Okay. Well, now I am a little... Oh, okay. I'm going to... Since I don't know what he could pull out here, I am going to use a heal here. I think we're okay. Okay. Yeah, we're fine. But I didn't want some shenaniganery to occur. Okay. He's just trying to flinch me every which way, huh? If you flinch me again, I swear to God. Bruh. All three of these are like 20%, man. I, there's no shot, right? Jesus. Ridiculous. Oh, a crit? I don't know if you would have lit that. But a crit? No chance. Okay. Oh, no. The devil. The devil has returned. Okay. So what, you got earthquake, drain punch, Winter strike. Okay, I think I think we just go Chloe here. Okay, do your worst. I, I'm kidding. Don't don't do. Venom, okay, that's fine. Oh, so fine. All right, now we're gonna just EQ you. Yeah, taste of your own medicine. Not so much fun when you're the one receiving, huh? Okay, almost dead. Black sludge. I wonder if. No, is, is there's not an item that I mean maybe a king strike, but there's not an item that like serene grace, but an item, right? I don't think so, because maybe that scour of a bug, whatever had it, because it just kept plunging, but it might have been getting lucky. It would droop. Oh, wait, pyro sound type. Well, good news, you're down in attack, uh, and I'm good into you too. This is great. Let's go, Chloe. Oh, we just clutched up. I, was that his ace? I don't know. Slurp off. Are we good? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, we needed this after the last episode, man. Oh, did we need this? Let's go. My team's showing up. Oh boy, you hit harder than the bass drum snare.
Oh, boy, how can you be this strong? Ah, whatevs, you nailed me good, fella. Last time I was beaten this much was when the old geezer was still nagging me. Ha, ha, ha. But this is the kind of beating that made me strong, turning me into who I am now. If I hadn't scrat snacked my head in that wall so much, I don't know where I'd be now. Fruit, if you have a dream, make it your son, your purpose in life. Even when everything seemed to fall apart, keep going and seize the day like you're seizing this badge. Thank you. We'll take the beat badge. Check. Microphone. Check. 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 One, two. Oh, Fruit Daddy back on the mic, mic, mic. See the ice? My beat badge is a nice piece of gold and it's all yours now. Ha ha. I promise you an autograph as well, but after what you did for my town, it wouldn't be enough. I want you to have this. Mm, a subwoofer, I'm assuming. It is subwoofer. Any Pokemon using move will, uh, any Pokemon using move will scream. Showing the photos through the bottom, making them flinch. Cool, huh? I'm sure a tough trainer will make you the best of the fruit. I swear I'm done with the chit chat. See you next time, buddy. I may have a special invite for the reason part of my next record. Screw you, Slurpuff. Do, 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 do. I'm, I'm checking out this team a whole bit. I want to, I want to see the exact damage. You can learn. I'm assuming it's special attack. That's physical. Um, I mean, it's still not bad. So, this might flinch, but how fast are we? I don't know. Jet strike's priority, which is always nice, but yeah, maybe I'll replace it for now. Feeling crazy. Okay, this team showed up for this gym. Proud of you all. Hey, Skeety. Yeah. So free. Sixth badge, I think, right? We're getting there. Uh, sh I don't want to say, you know, it's easy sailing because, well, it was until... I mean, that just goes that's as quick as it can take a turn, you know? It's like, what the fudge, man? Scorched uh, Ashes came in clutch, too. I'm not going to lie. Just having everything do uh, like 25% less damage. Yeah, sure. It's a nice move. I like that. It's good. It's real good. I'm going to keep it. I think I'll keep it. Yeah. yeah. It's a move they made for this, right? It's sick. That's what it is. Da, 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 da. Uh, I could keep switching the team around for levels, but uh, it, it feels inevitable. I can't, I don't know what to do. Because, like, that's the weird part is like, yeah, the Xenoverse was 46. But then, like, the trainers in the gym were like 40, 42. Like, it's such a weird, I don't know. I, I don't know what to do. You know, and to be honest, I'm kind of sick of just moving things around. I'm being honest with you. Um, what uh, you know, what I will do, we'll get Rapid Ash in. I, I want to see Rapid Ash at work. Sounds fun. We'll you know we'll take Avon away for now. Sarah, you still get a little bit of a break. Ryan Dingo, that's right. Do I want to throw you in here somewhere? Or we could uh, Fat Tail, Fat Tail, have you ever seen it? And uh, Spiritomb here. Good coverage. And if that's the case, we kind of have two electrics, even though you're not quite... Mm, I think the Spiritomb is just too nice. Too nice with it. Right? Uh, it's two ghost types. Could go dark. I, 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 I don't know. Hmm... Let's just, let's just go with Spirit Tomb for now. Sure. Two ghosts. Actually, wait, no, that's three ghost types. Oh, wait. Uh, I really need to get Lievany, I guess. Okay, fine. Sarah, I guess you're in here. Although we could overheat back in or even... Um, Ron Dahor or Ryan Dahor. Uh, you, know, you know me in names. Ron Dahor or something like that. Let's go with that. Okay. Dion Rohor. I'll get you up to like 40. I, I'll get you up you to 45. How about that? You and Rapidash can be a little behind. Which, which is okay. Because everyone else just keeps sailing by. So. I just learned Screech at level 44. My dude, what are you doing? Let's talk about that. Betuna. Bat. 
Let's start with Batna too, because I wanna I wanna see this in action. Yes, sir. Alright. So where exactly am I going? An excellent question. I'm assuming that way, I guess. What's up here? What's this? Sorry, mate, but we're gonna go, we're working on stuff. Oh. Huh. Okay. No, no. Let's go. Hopefully not. Samuel Oak Airport. Huh? Samuel Oak Airport. Okay, yeah. I figured that much out. Oh, no. No chance my... No chance she fights me. Hi there, Fruit. Were you still in town? I would have really liked to see Wallace Daddy's concert, but I had a lot to do for Astro and I missed it. What about you? Let me tell ya. All my mons are dead. <laughs> you managed to see him live and get his badge? Wow! I didn't know you were a fan of his, but your victory doesn't surprise me anymore. I also became stronger since last time. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, I want to show you. Right after the... Okay, I think we're fine. We're fine. We're... Okay, we... We are flying type. Your defense, I'm just, like, if I get hit, go down 50, I need to see, like, do, do my stats change, am I only electric? And then, with all that, if I heal out of 50% range, do I untransform? Uh, I know I probably shouldn't, but I'm going to test those questions right now. Thunderbolt? Well, how do you know T-Bolt? Mine doesn't... You've got... How the fudge? Without a crit... Same level... Special defense wasn't... Bruh. I mean, I was playing a dangerous game. Bruh, that is... Uh. Wanted to use rapid... <laughs> I don't even get to see what it... Oh my god. That's so pepic of me. I know, but I wanted to... I was like, oh, this is great. A super effective might put me... A third health? Maybe a quarter? Pushing it. But then I should change to electric type. We'll either be neutral or resist if I get rid of flying. I'll heal. And then we got a beater. So stupid. But yeah, that was avoidable. God. That one's on me. That one's on me. How much do I even have against this thing? I have Voltas on. That's what the fudge I have. Oh, sheesh. So stupid. I could... I'm pissed. I wanted to use that rapid ash so bad. I hate everything. <sighs> Shadow Ball. Episode was going so well. And I, then I had to do that. Just go full Pepiga. Man. Also, why didn't you use an electric attack, my dude? You didn't know I had Voltibs. I could have had something else. God. An Eevee? I'm insulted. An Eevee, what the fuck? Watch it kill me. Okay, well, I'm out of here. Of course, you have dark. And we do be times four weak. 
That is a little chink in our uh, tank's chainmail. Time for a week to dark. Ay, ay, ay. You have dark. I mean, I'm not worried about you hurting me that much, but whatever. You know, what? I'm gonna, I'm just gonna set up ten with some D dances. You're gonna watch it. You're gonna like it. I'm gonna sweep everything else you have. I don't care. I don't. This is what your Eevee could be, but you play him. So. Yeah, this is greed. This is what Dalfout, Dalfout could have had. Oh, oh, we're going. Yeah. You're like, no shot. Yeah, plus three, baby. Okay, I can just kill everything now. Not that I was really worried about it before. Pikachu? Fudge. You're fairy type, aren't you? Oh, gosh. I'm plus three D dance, man. Don't do it. Don't click that. <sighs> I think we win. Even with, because at, at plus three, it's 150% or 75% 75% extra damage. Resistance, so I'm technically doing 25% extra damage than normal. I'm practically critting. But I'm still not. I'm not doing it. I just know. I just know something would go wrong. And had the Rapidash incident not happened, maybe I would have done that. But the Rapidash incident did happen. And if I lost another Mon here, I would just give up. Hysteria. Yeah, you're done. Because, like, that's the thing. Like, that's why I talk about it. Like, yeah, I know that wasn't the thing. But sometimes I do like to push the envelope. Things like that can happen. But also, I didn't think that that would happen. Uh, man. Because why do you know T-Bolt? You don't learn that. It's a TM you can find. Why does yours know Thunderbolt? I don't get it. Wow, you sure don't hold back. <laughs> you know, I always enjoy seeing you and finding you. I have to go to see you. Screw you. No. Don't give me that. Okay, well. We pick up from here, ladies and gentlemen. Should be new encounters. Um, less Papega. Screw that, man. From now on, I don't even care if I'm like, oh, I just want to see her. I know this might happen, but let's push the envelope. No. I'm playing Sweaty McGee from here on out, dude. This lost Rapidash, man. Now, granted, if Rapidash was that frail, then any super effective hit here or in the future probably would have done it in. But I'll never know. So stupid. I never thought it would get hit one hit by something. Because otherwise it could have put like focus sash on it. But I never thought. <sighs> Sorry guys. That one's on me. Remember to like the video. Comment down below. I'll see you guys on Monday. Still a positive episode. But a negative note to end it on. Gabba the goop, huh? What are you going to do? Fruit Daddy will be back on Monday. Deuces.